two provincial ministers met today in Prince George to work together on a challenge facing the North. The B.C. Jobs Minister and the Minister of Advanced Education are joining forces to meet demand. They've announced a new program to get First Nations into mining. Ministers Shirley Bond and Amrick Virk took some time to announce a joint educational opportunity for First Nations in the Northwest. The College of New Caledonia and the Northwest Community College are jointly providing a Camp Cook program. This type of collaboration is essential moving forward and I'm very encouraged to see this kind of programming where you're seeing expertise come from two colleges and then a, a wonderful organization who has a proven track record in their training program. So, you know, this is about ensuring that British Columbians and in this case in particular First Nations uh, uh, young people have a chance to participate in the jobs market. The summit camps will put the students right in the mining camps to get hands-on experience over four weeks. Virk says it's just one of the many forthcoming opportunities for training. Opportunities in the north are, are a synergy of a whole bunch of careers and, and uh, this is one of them. And so, you know, when you add up all the sums of all the different kind of training programs, you're going to get to the net equation. So th this is an important skill that's required. The industry, the oil and gas industry, the exploration industry, and our future uh, LNG industry is going to require a whole host of skills. The colleges will be working with the BC Aboriginal Mine Training Association to provide the course. It's the beginning of a new relationship in training. Let's look at every opportunity for co-locating collaboration and partnerships. You know, there was an environment where we had healthy competition but now it's all about collaboration and working together and here you have an example where you have the Aboriginal uh, institution, you have two post-secondary institutions plus you have industry with summit camps coming together. The four-week program is targeting one of the fastest growing pools of professional, Aboriginal youth. If you look at where we're going to get our workforce in the future, you know, it, the uh, First Nations young people are the fastest growing demographic, they're the youngest uh, population in our province, so along with women and persons with disabilities, we need to make sure that we're tapping all of the potential uh, for the jobs of the future. This is the first time these three organizations have worked together to provide a single training opportunity. Cheryl Jan, CKPG News.